Coming to the next question, children. What is the next number? in the sequence below. Okay, your options are the sequence is 2, 6, 18, 54 and dash. Okay, the options are 216, Option B, 162, Option C, 108, and Option D, 165. Fine. So, here they are asking us to follow the sequence pattern. So, 2, 6, 18, 54. So, what is a common thing that you can observe here, children? Just try to multiply and see. I can say 2 into 3 is equals to 6. Right? I can say 6 into 3 is equals to 18. Right? Then I can say 18 into 3 is how much? 8 3 is a 24. 2, 1 3 is a 3. 3 plus 2 is 5. 54. Right? So, which means that I have to multiply each number into 3 in order to complete the sequence. So, what will I do now? 54 into 3. Okay? So, let us multiply and see what is 54 into 3. 4 3s are 12. 1, 1 5 3s are 15. 15 plus 1 is 16. So, which is 162. So, that is option B. Clear? Shall we move to the next one? Okay. So, the next question for you is. Which of the following numbers. has the least number of factors. Okay. The options are 12, option B, 15, option C, 13, and option D, 20. Okay. So, now the question is asking which number has got least number of factors. Coming to 12, we know that what are the factors of 12 children? 1, 2, 3, 4, 6 and 12. Right. Let us come to the factor of 15. So, 15 is 1, 3, 5 and 15. Right. What is the factor value of 13? It is 1 and 13. Just two of them, which means that it is a prime number. Right. Coming to 20, it is 1, 2, 4, 5, 10, 20. So, which is having the least number of factors, children? Yes, it is. C13 because it is a prime number. Got it? Shall we move to the next question? Okay. The next question for you is find the total number of factors. Find the total number of factors. of 18. Okay. Your options are 3, 4, 5 and 6. So, let us see how many factors are there for 18. Okay. So, we can say 1 into 18 is 18. Then 2 into 9 is equals to 18. Then 
3 into 6 equals to 18. 4 we do not have, 5 we do not have. So, 6 into 3 is equals to 18, 9 into 2 is equals to 18 and 18 into 1 equals to 18. So, how many are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6. So, how many are there children? It is D6. Okay. So, which will be 1, 2, 3, 6, 9 and 18. Clear? Shall we move ahead? Okay. So, the next question for you is, which number is a factor of 12. The options given are 10, option B 7, option C 5 and option D 6. So, which of the given number is a factor of 12? So, is 10 a factor of 12 children? No. Is 7 a factor of 12? No. Is 5 a factor of 12? No. Is 6 a factor of 12? 6 1s are 6, 6 2s are 12, right? So, 6 is uh, 12 is uh, divided by 2 times in order to get the 6, right? So, 6 is the right answer. Clear? Shall we move to the next one? Okay. So, here is your next question. The question says, which number is not a factor of 8. Okay. And the options given are 3, option B 2, option C 1 and option D 8. So, here the question asks which is not a factor of 8. So, is it possible to divide 3 with 8? No. Is it possible to divide 8 with 2? Yes. 2 is a factor of 8. 1 is a factor of 8. 8 is a factor of 8. So, which means option A3 is not a factor of 8. So, option A is the right answer. Shall we do the next sum children? Oh, 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 oh,